I am the Tulip Fairy. <laughs> bye bye. Look how cute. It has nothing to do with the Yay! Yeah. Yippee! Welcome to Allison in Europe. Yay! So, yeah, uh, I'm here in the Netherlands and I'm actually staying in Utrecht, not Amsterdam, because, um, all right, so we're doing this trip on a budget, like a budget, but not hostels, because I can't sleep, uh, like, when I'm surrounded by other people like that. So, yeah. I'm here alone in Europe and it is a beautiful day out. We're gonna go see the tulips today. I do have a friend who lives here in the Netherlands, so I'm gonna be spending a lot of time with her while I'm here. And then after I spend a few days here in the Netherlands, I'm gonna go to France and that is gonna be totally solo. I don't know anyone there. But we'll see how it goes. Yeah, actually this is my first time doing a solo international trip. It's a little after nine right now. I already went to the supermarket. I'm so happy because I feel so like different than what I'm used to. So it's like a little scary, but like nothing I can't handle. You know, you got to push yourself. So I'm gonna eat breakfast out on my, um, my terrace. Uh, so I'm gonna go do that. And then I'm gonna go see the tulips. Thankfully, it is a sunny day. Thank God. And actually this Airbnb is really great. Uh, I'm gonna Give you a tour of it later. Yay, I'm excited. I know we're not in Japan like usual, but I promise we're gonna have fun. Me and me and you. I don't know why I'm pointing to my forehead. Okay. <laughs> all around us. <laughs> We're here at the Julep. Where are we? Hugenhof. How, how are it? How are it? How are it? How is it? <laughs> it's fine. It's fun. The weather's nice. Yeah. Some good food. We're just like looking up some pretty flowers. They're so pretty. You're just so pretty. like us. <laughs> <laughs> that view. It's a good 
good view. <laughs> and it's good. Slay. <laughs> Like a peaceful Disney. <laughs> Ice cream queens. That's cute. Why isn't it spinning? All right, I'm in Amsterdam, and I'm gonna meet up with my friend now. It's a very different vibe from where I'm staying in Utrecht. They were not kidding about the weed smell in the city. Amsterdam. What do you think of Amsterdam, baby? It sucks. I hate it here. Okay, that's great. That's a great review. <laughs> We're having fun. <laughs> it's, just, it's just a lot of a lot of smells. It smells like weed. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing else. It's just that. And and rain. It smells like that too. Yeah. Look how cute. It's cute. Oh, look at that. This is so Amsterdam. Yeah, look how cute. <laughs> look at look at that. Does it get any more Dutch than this? This is this Dutch. Is this is it. This is all you're gonna get. <laughs> Does it get more Dutch than this? This is the Netherlands. <laughs> Amsterdam. What was your pie review? It was really filling. Yeah. It was good. It was good. 
It was filling. Don't eat lunch before you go there like we did. <laughs> Don't do it. Australia. And four figures that represent the points of the compass, inside and out, with all kinds of nautical symbols, anchors, ships. Boring is such a great time. It has nothing to do with running the The facade is the Yay! We made it! Hi, baby! Goods acquired. Let's go! Good morning everyone. It is yet another day here in the Netherlands. I don't say beautiful because I cannot predict this country's weather and I've accepted that. It was sunny day one, it was sunny day two. Yesterday it was rainy all day long. Today, I don't know. I see the sun peeking through the clouds, but it may all go away in an hour. We don't know. So today I'm gonna go to Rotterdam because that's where my friend's from and she is going to show me her city. <laughs> uh, yeah, so yeah, we went to the flowers. That was really good. And then yesterday we went to Amsterdam. I did not like the touristy, like the red light district, like all that stuff. I didn't, I don't like that. It felt dirty and not that good. But the parts away from that, I liked a lot. And I'm, I was so shocked. Like I, I knew people in Amsterdam spoke English, but I didn't know like they'd, like they first talked to you in English. That's just how it is. I think in Amsterdam, everyone just speaks English. But here in uh, where I'm staying in Utrecht, people speak Dutch. First, on that note, let's go get breakfast. So beautiful. I was born and raised here I'd be like happier as a person I don't know everything's so peaceful and nice everyone's nice and I don't know <laughs> ah! sure is different from suburban Florida I'll tell you that <laughs>
God, look at that. Yeah. yeah. The mayor works here. Maybe. Never trust Dutch weather. I'm here to experience Dutch culture. you guys so I am leaving the Netherlands today uh, Wow so I was only here for three full days and I kind of wish I made it four or even five I could have done five but it is what it is and all the more reason to come back sometime in the future before I move on to France which I'm gonna do basically completely solo by the way so in the Netherlands I'm, I'm alone like in here but one of my friends basically hung out with me the whole time <laughs> Thank you, Stel. <laughs> yeah, so from here, it's gonna be more, uh, we just try. <laughs> but I wanted to do a haul of what I bought and also just give my overall thoughts. So first, let me just do a quick haul. Warning, it is all Miffy merch or Nainche, Nainche, Nainche. I'm sorry. Let's start with the food actually. So this is, most of the Stel bought me. I have two Milka bars. Not sure when I'm gonna eat them. <laughs> Might bring them back with me. And I have some lints. And then these fruit things, I ate one. They taste like Laffy Taffy from America, if you know what that is. And then I bought these Stroop waffles on my own. I was intending to eat them here, but uh, I didn't. So I guess I'm just gonna bring them with me for now. They're kind of heavy, but uh, the fresh one I ate yesterday was really, really good. Okay, and then Stell also bought me. <laughs> She's so nice. Um, these Miffy scrunchies. This green one's Miffy, super cute. And then she bought me a little Miffy, oh, so cute. And a face mask, which I think I'll maybe do in Paris or something. And she bought me this teacup set thing with Miffy. It's so, so cute. So that's gonna get a lot of use. And then what I bought myself, so I got two Miffy things. One is this magnet in the Dutch blue colors. Um, I forgot what it's called, but there's a word for it. And then this is like my Netherlands souvenir. It's a Miffy and see she's in a tulip outfit. Um, her outfit's adorable. And then lastly, I got this from the tulip garden. It's a magnet again. I like to collect magnets. So honestly, I like the Netherlands a lot more than I thought I would. I don't know. I didn't have really like, any expectations going in because I didn't do that much research because my friend lives here. So I knew she would like help me out. And I also knew that people here spoke English. So I wasn't as worried and they do indeed speak English. I had a really nice time and I'd like to come back. Yeah, I think it's a very beautiful country and everyone here has been so nice and I really like it. I really like it. I get why people move here, but okay. So to wrap this up, I thought I'd do a quick Airbnb tour. So I decided to stay in Utrecht basically because the hotels in Amsterdam were so expensive. Staying here was actually a lot cheaper, like compared to like a small hotel room in Amsterdam or like this huge Airbnb here in Utrecht and even with the train fee I'm still saving at least 50 euros a day which is worth it for me especially because like I only really wanted to spend one day in Amsterdam anyway because the trains here are actually like really really good I'm really impressed by the trains they're like very on time and there's a lot of them they're a bit expensive but mm. Anyway, so I showed you this before, but yeah, we have the canal view terrace thing out here. I'm not gonna go outside because it's a little rainy as always, but then this is, it's huge. So this is like a old boathouse. And it's like, it looks, it's so much bigger in real life than it was in the pictures. Like this couch is huge. My apartment in Japan probably cuts off right here. And then back here is like the bedroom. And we have a little thing and yeah, it keeps going, you guys, it keeps going. So this is the kitchen I did cook two dinners here to save money. We got an oven and a fridge and everything. And then finally in the back is the bathroom. So we got a shower and then just normal bathroom. Yeah. So thank you guys for following this uh, Netherlands edition of my solo, this was kind of solo trip, but um, yeah, watch the next video if you want to see me in France, that will be very solo and we'll see how it goes. Okay, thank you, bye.